Oh, we turned the lights on. Oh, the radio again. Perfect. Oh, I have the second part this time. Oh. The, Are you still with me? Yeah. <laughs> the talented Amali Raven has returned from Switzerland. She is... Oh, wait. This isn't right. That's oh. the first one. No, sorry. I get that. <laughs> sorry. Three patients from the nursing home in Hilbeck Hilbe have vanished in the middle of the night. Uh, the talented Amali Raven has returned from Switzerland. She is determined to reopen and bring back glory to Raven's clocks. The police are looking for anyone who is in the vicinity of the nursing home yesterday evening. They are asking for assistance finding the missing patients. The post office's water damages is repaired and all post boxes are ready. To be used again. There is already a letter in post box 34. The tragic nursing home incident has reopened old wounds in our village. We hope these disappearances won't remain unsolved like those five years ago. We have no news when our train service will return to our village again. The station is now permanently closed. Uh, Clarissa Shar, the generous benefactor of our new clock tower, died last month. At the opening ceremony next week, we will honor her memory. Now people are disappearing. <laughs> It's evolved. Okay. Okay. I've left the clock shop. Me too. deal with is this morse code puzzle mm. wait when you go into like the the french horn building yeah <laughs> um what do you see in there um they might be like safes maybe um can you go to 34 oh yeah and can you push the button or no i can but it does nothing i can turn these little like The little spindle thing. Yeah. That's what I was looking at earlier. There's a letter in box 34. Yeah. I'm trying to think if I've seen. Can you try? That's only two, though. Southeast is only two. South and southeast are only two directions. Oh, okay. So maybe we have four. So go back to the, um,. Go back to the house. I mean, wait, is this the house or is this the clock thing? Okay, the clock store, the clock shop. Okay. And then back to the basement. Okay. Um, when you look at the screen, do you see two X's? Yeah. What are your two X's? Northeast. And... Northeast. <laughs> Well, oh, so they're north and east? Yeah. Okay. So, to open that box, you need northeast, southeast, and south. Oh, okay, I see. Mm -hmm. Where'd it go? So, northeast, then what? Southeast, which is in between south and east. Southeast. And then south. South. And then press a button. But I need one more. Well, what were the directions you had on yours? Just northeast? You only had one? Oh, wait. No, there are two X's. They were both northeast. Oh, so point two at northeast. 
I did, and that didn't work. Both X's are on northeast. I think so. I accidentally hit the on button again, and now it's gone. There's one south, and there's one southeast, and you know one is northeast, try fiddling with the two positions around northeast for the last one and see if it'll give it to you. Or if you want, we can do that puzzle again. <laughs> we probably should, just because I don't... You can do the puzzle again. Sorry. That's right. I didn't realize turning it We're off We're experts at this puzzle now. <laughs> Oops. No. Alright, are you ready? Hold on. Uh, now that this machine is extra loud. Yes. <laughs> I'm ready. Well, okay, okay. So, instead of that, look at the two needles above it. Like, the two pressure gauges. Yeah. What are they pointed at? They're like in between N and E, so northeast, I assume. Both of them are pointed at the same spot? Yes. I think. Yeah, they are. And hold on, let me double check. And you, you went to post box 34? Yes. And then... You put two needles in the spot that were on your side. Yeah, I'm not sure I'm not... exactly what to do. Because... <laughs> well, there are, like, mm -hmm. four needles. Mm hmm Which one do I start with? The top one? Sure. Start with the top one and move it to the northeast. Okay. And then the next one would be the right one. Mm-hmm. And I would move that one back up to the northeast as well. Okay. And then... And then I'd take the bottom one and I would move that to the southeast. Okay. And then I'd take the one on the far left and move it to the bottom. Point it south. I just did that and it didn't work! Now it works! <sighs> maybe it really did make a difference which needle you use. Yeah, maybe. Okay, so it's a piece of paper. It says, Post Office mm -hmm. Telegram. It feels like I was gone for such a long time, but for all the time I was away, it still felt short. Too short to finish my invention. Now we will have the longest lives ever, longer than you could imagine. When you repeated this message, I'll guide your way. First of all, immortality, am I right? But other than that, can you reread that one more time? Yes. It feels like I was gone for such a long time. But for all the time I was away, it still felt short. Too short to finish my invention. Now we will have the longest lives ever. Longer than you could imagine. When you've repeated this message, I'll guide your way. When you've repeated this message, I'll guide your way. There are a lot of shorts and longs. <laughs> okay. There are a lot of shorts and longs. Okay, so... Tell me what they are. In, like... In order? Yeah, mm-hmm. Uh, long is first. Do do it, like, three at a time. So, like, long, long, short. Oh, okay. Um, long, short, short. Okay. Longest, longer... That's it. <laughs> you 
You threw me off with longest and longer. Yeah, <laughs> that's what it is. So you've got one dash, two dots, and then a really long dash, and then another really long dash. What the heck does that mean? So, like, so when you're looking at it, you've got, like, a dash. What am I looking at? Dots. Or. Okay, so when you're saying. Okay, so tell me again what you have. That says, like, long, short, short. Okay, the first one is long. And it, it literally says the word long? Yes. Okay. The next one is short. Mm -hmm. The next one is short, too, but it says too short? I don't know if that makes a difference. Oh, I think it does. Like T-O-O. -O. So, I'm sorry. Say it again. So it's... Start from the beginning. Long. And you can go slow. Long, okay. Short. Short. Too short. Okay. Longest. Alright. Longer. Mm -hmm. And that's it. Even with that, I'm still missing four. Okay, so let's... Longest and longer are the last two, right? Yes. Two, three... How many did I say was missing? I don't know. Four? <laughs> I think so. Crap. Okay, so it's long. Mm -hmm. Short, short? Yeah. What's after that? Longest and longer. Well, I mean, like, what does it literally say? It says long. And then what does it say after that? Because you said there was a too short in there. Oh, long time. Whoa. <laughs> what? You said long time? Yeah, I'm reading from the message I read. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What does the message say verbatim? It, the whole thing? <laughs> well, just, just the part about the long and the shorts. That's the whole thing. What do you mean? You know that, like, paragraph I read? Mm-hmm. It just has those words in it. Do you want me to read it again? <laughs> yes, please. It feels like I was gone for such a long time, but for all the time I was away, it still felt short. Too short to finish my invention. Now we will have the longest lives ever, longer than you can imagine. When you've repeated this message, I'll guide your way. And I assume those words are highlighted no. somehow? Oh, so you just picked them out of there? I just guessed because there were a lot of them. <laughs> oh. Can you read the first sentence again? Yeah. <laughs> it feels like I was gone for such a long time. Feels like I was gone for such a long time. Okay, what's the next sentence? But for all the time I was away, it still felt short. Too short to finish my invention. last sentence? Now we will have the longest lives ever. Longer than you could imagine. Now we'll have the longest lives ever. Longer than you can imagine. Wait. When you... How many letters do you get when you did what you did before? How, what do you mean? What, what are you doing? Letters? 
I'm trying to Morse code. I'm sorry, what? I'm trying to do Morse code. Okay. And there's ten characters. There's either ten dashes... Well, it's a combination of ten dashes and dots. Okay, and how many do you get? What do you mean? Like, you need ten, right? Yeah. How many have you gotten? It, there's, it's either I get all of them or none of them. Like, it, it's not telling me if I'm getting even part of it right. So I essentially have to get all ten of them right to know if they're right. Well, yeah, I know, but... I don't think that I have any of them correct. Well, it doesn't matter if they're correct. Like, how many do you have right now? Five. You do? Mm -hmm. Well, the last, the last sentence says, when you've repeated this message, I'll guide your way. So that, does that mean you have to do it again? Yep, I just got yeah. it. Yeah! <laughs> it's long, short, short, long, long. And then I repeat it. Yeah. And now... It's a pattern. It opened up a thing. And then it... Okay, this pattern's gonna have to start over from the beginning. <laughs> So hold on. Okay. Okay, pattern, go. Any minute now. <laughs> go. Do I have to click on you to get you to go? Go. It's not working. What if you leave and come back? Oh, wait, okay. No, it toyed with my emotions. It did one thing and then it was done. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Perfect. Okay. Uh, is it perfect? <laughs> <Left>. <laughs> eight, six, nine, twelve. Damn it! I have no idea what's going on in your head. <laughs> okay. So the. The Morse code thing, thank you for that, by the way. We clutched the hardest, um, the hardest thing in the game. Yeah. This thing opened, and there's, like, a light inside of it. Hold on. Okay. So there's a, it's, it's the little Morse code d -d 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 thing <laughs> attached to a speaker, okay. which is attached to a light. Okay. The light is flashing in a pattern of like dim and bright. Okay. Mm yeah. So I am going to assume that relates to the ligata bulbs. <laughs> okay. <laughs> The thing is, that it gave me 12, 12, like, things in a pattern, and there are, um, one, two, three, four, there are 12 bulbs on each side, you know what I'm saying? So, I don't know, should I check to see if the pattern repeats, or if I get a different pattern? What am I supposed to do about my raven, though? I know. What the heck? 
So the pattern, the pattern does repeat. Help, how do I escape? <laughs> Get me out of here. here okay. I can't escape while the thing is going off. So I don't know if the light bulbs... Oh, I wonder if you get the other half of the pattern from the raven. Cool. Let me try this half. One, two, three. One, two, three. One. One, two. Okay, where was that raven? It was in the house? Uh... Yes. Okay, everything we need for solving this damn raven puzzle has to be involved in this picture. Why is there a Morse code thing on the left, though? <gasps> okay, so... Uh, Alright, so... <laughs> this raven thing... Yeah. I understand now. This raven's gonna give you the second half of the pattern. Oh. All right. Mm -hmm. Uh, it has to do with the raven head, and there's an image of the raven head. So try, but there's mm, one, two, three, four, five, six. There's seven letters on here. Okay. On this this raven head picture, the ones that relate specifically to the head are C, X, and I. Okay, let me see. C. <sighs> Shit. <laughs> Is there a problem? Well, I can only go, like, if I click them, they go one forward. So if I skipped X, I have to go through all the letters again. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I know what you're saying, and uh, I feel <laughs> Okay. So C, X, what? <laughs> And I. I. I don't know if you need to do an alphabetical order. I don't know if it's C-I-X. Okay, I did it and nothing happened. Okay. The other part of this picture has the letters... Did you do C-X-I? Yeah. Can you try C-I-X? Yes. Yeah. Because it might need to be alphabetical. Yeah, that didn't do anything either. Okay, there's another, um, like, piece on this. Oh, wait, can you, after you do it, can you click the bird head to see if it does anything? Other than shift everything forward? No, it doesn't shift everything, it shifts one of the letters forward. Can you poke the bird in the head anyway, just because we're I did. Nothing okay. happened. Um, so the other piece in this picture has th three letters associated, and it's B H X. B. God. Click through. <laughs> B. Okay, that didn't do anything. Crap on his speak. That did nothing. I'm low key irritated by this. <laughs> I remember I still have those, like, three other random letters. What do you mean? Remember they were, like, those weird Swedish letters? Oh, good lord. So there's an A and an E that are together. Mm -hmm. Like, a zero or an O, like, crossed out. Like, with a slash down it, or a diagonally. Okay. 
and an A with like a circle on top of it, and that's it. Yeah. <laughs> I know, I know what you're referring to. I can picture all of those letters in my head. The answer has to be in the house. Yeah. Let me click on more things. Maybe... Maybe it's something... Because I have two candles here. Maybe I can light something on fire. <laughs> There's my solution to everything. Just light it on fire. There's books. There's like a little metal contraption that does nothing. Oh... There's nothing on the floor. Didn't, didn't you used to be able to like, wasn't, didn't the instructions say you could rotate things? Yeah, I don't remember how though. I think it said that. Yeah, I vaguely remember seeing something about rotation too. Let this raven got... out. I know. Just knock the cage over. <laughs> I can't. I'm like clicking on everything. I figured this one out. I mean, it doesn't really, unfortunately. Okay. So maybe the answer to the crow is somewhere else. Let me look around. Okay. So we're looking for three letters. Yeah. Try ATT. Try RVN. Let me just try to be real on the nose about it. That didn't do anything. <laughs> Characters. There's what's what's the name of the not the the evil one, but the less than evil. I don't know what that means. Oh, try K O L. Okay. That's the bird's flipping name. Oh. Yep, that worked. Well, there we go! <laughs> oh god. Looks like a real raven now. Or a crow. Or what? What is it? A crow? Raven? It's a, oh. it's a raven. Oh! Mm -hmm. I touched it and now it's cawing. And, and like a pattern and its eyes light up sometimes. Yep, you're gonna have to pay attention to that pattern. I would recommend writing it down. Oh no! What? <laughs> okay. Why? I'm bad at this. No, just all you have to do, every time it caws, it's like an entry. And all you need to do is note whether or not its eyes are lit or not. So you can just well, put like, lit, not, not, lit, lit, not, lit. Well, sometimes it does a short caw and then a long caw. And sometimes its eyes light up and then... 
Let me look at it again. Yeah, you shouldn't have to worry about the length. You just need to know oh, the pattern of lit okay, and I not see. lit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's kind of cute. <laughs> oh, man. Stupid bird. <laughs> okay, so we're leaving this this house forever. Okay. Okay, and we're gonna st and we're gonna stare at the clock tower. Okay. Okay, there. Yep. Okay, so you remember that drawing that had absolutely nothing to do with the crow puzzle? What? And ha remember that drawing? The, the one that's in Discord right now. The one from the middle? Okay, yeah. You see how the right half is the crow and the left half is the Morse code? Yeah. So these relate to the light bulbs that are hanging up. So you should have 12 things in your pattern regarding the lights. Yeah, I do. <laughs> yeah. So we're, the crow starts on the right side. So we're going to start with yours, and then we're going to shift to the right as we go along. And then the um, we're going to pick up with the Morse code one on the other side, which I have. Okay. Okay, so starting from bow one, is it on or off? off. Okay. The next one? Uh, Lit. Okay. So we're doing the next we're just one? doing the right side of the screen. Correct. Okay. The next one is not lit. Okay. So bulb number 4. Um they're all lit. <laughs> all three of them. Okay. And then the next three? Um not lit, not lit and then lit. Okay. Got it. Right? And then the last three. Lit, lit and then not lit. Okay, so this this is the point where mine picks up. Okay. So we've got not lit, lit, not lit. Okay. Okay, next one is not lit, not lit, lit. Okay. And then the next one, all three are lit. Ooh. And then... Oh, wait. I lost that. <coughs> let, me, uh, let me double check my pattern. Okay. Let's... <laughs> Bright, dim. Dim, dim, bright. Okay. Dim, dim, bright, bright, bright. Okay, so the three that you're looking at that I said to light all three, I lied. The last one's not lit. Okay. And then on the last three, it's lit, lit, not lit. That didn't work for me. Open. It, didn't, it didn't work for you? Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. Um, I'm going to assume that your side is right. Okay. So start all the way from, so all the way from the music house. Or the music store, the French horn store, whatever that is. Uh-huh. And then we're going to start from the three bulbs on the right, because that's where mine start. Okay. okay. So for those, those three bulbs, it's off on off. Wait. So the three bulbs on the left side or the right side? On the right side. The three bulbs on the right. Okay. Side. So it should be off, on, off. Okay. Then off, off, on. Then on, on, off. And now that you're looking at, you should be looking at the clock tower again, and it's on, on, off. I think I'm messing something up. So your side, so starting, when you're looking at the clock tower, the three bulbs on the right, okay? Uh -huh. It should be off, on, off. Okay. And the next three should be on, on, on. So on the left. Yes, the three on the left should be on, on, on. And the three on the right should be off, off, on. Okay. And then on the next screen, the three bulbs on the left should be on, on, off. Okay. And the bulbs on the right should be off, on, off. Okay. And then, uh, what are you looking at right now? The, the clock, the shop. Okay, so the three on the left should be off, off, on. Okay. And the three on the right should be on, on, off. And at this point you should be looking at the clock tower yeah. again. 
and the three bulbs on the left should be on, on, off. Oh, okay, it worked. That was weird. There we Thanks. go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm going into the clock tower. <laughs> All right. Um... I'm clicking the bushes. Ain't nothing going on. All right, I'm going up. Uh, or I would, because there's a ladder. Oh, I gotta drop the ladder down. Oh Whoa. god, some ghosts popped out. That turned into letters. Yeah, me too. Aha, Switzerland! <laughs> I knew it. All those years in Switzerland made it possible for me to finally finish the clockwork. Uh, is what that says. My last memory of Lark was the suspicious frown on her face. Okay. Um, second floor says, I double-checked Lark's clock. It ran exactly as it should. At first, she didn't want the clock. She said it was tired of my presence. And presence is like gifts. Oh, okay. Um, the third floor, it didn't occur to me that a crack in the clock face would make a difference. I held it out to her anyways because I needed her to be with me. I'm confused by this story. Me too. What? On the f on the fourth level, I have a bunch of jars with numbers on yeah. it. Yeah. Are we on the fourth level? Me okay. too. They have numbers on them. Yeah, same. Mm -hmm. But I can pull down the ladder anyway. He said, I had spent years collecting time for us. Time that would be added to our lives. I'm sorry, you cut out. Can you say that again? Uh, I had spent years collecting time for us. Time that would be added to our lives. Oh my god. There's more jars. <laughs> you cut out again. What the heck is go- oh, What- Okay, hold on. <laughs> Let me- Okay. Um, it says, I had spent years collecting time for us. Time that would be added to our lives. Okay. I never told her that the time was stolen. Only that the clock would let us be together forever. There's even more jars with numbers here. Um, instead, she disappeared into the clock. I still haven't found her. She closed her hand around the clock, and I never saw her again. Alright, I'm on the top floor. Yeah. And there's jars and one jar on a table with nothing yes, on same. it. Yes, same. I clicked on the jar. And captured, um, Navi. <laughs> 161, my jar says. Mine too. What? I didn't have to build a way out. I hope you and your friend appreciate it. Mine says, is what it you beat the game. Said. Such a shame to see all that time go to waste. I didn't have to build a way out. Whoa! I've lost 161 minutes of my yeah. life. Yeah. I'd lose another 161. I'd be okay with that. Have Amelie added 161 minutes to Lark hers. would have added 161 so minutes to hers. So I guess they stole our time. I guess so. Nice. Credits are rolling. I like that yeah. game. I like co-op games. They're fun. Yeah. Like, especially co-op puzzle games. We should, um... We should play We Were Here Together Again or whatever the most You already played it, is. though. No, the most recent one. I played We Were Here Together and We Were Here Together 2. Those are the only two I've oh. played. I haven't played the newest one. That game is scary. Have you s <laughs> It's not- I mean, it's got a few elements of spookiness, but... It's not, like, a scary game. This game had elements of spookiness. Yeah. And you made it! It was interesting. I really want you to do the, um... 
I really want you to do this side so you can deal with that. <laughs> I'm not going to give you any of the clues. <laughs> You're just going to have to sit on that screen for hours. Just with that stupid bird pecking at your puzzle. <laughs>